guys, this is Doc M, and we are playing Rome Total War, one of the all time classics. It's, yeah, released in 2004, so the graphics might be not the best, but hey, as we learned from Minecraft, gameplay is what counts. This game has many sequels, follow ups. At the moment, the latest installment is Shogun Total War, Rome Total War 2 will come out late this year around October and yeah I really wanted to get into it again I love to play it back in the days when it came out and I just went through the prologue you know just to get a basic idea how things work again I think I yeah forgot some things but we will we will get back into it and yeah to start it up with the Imperial Imperial campaign this is the main play oh yeah main main campaign basically we can start with three different fractions here and or factions better say and yeah the goal is um, to become the supreme ruler of Rome and control at least 50 provinces I mean something like that you want to rule the world you want to just be the most powerful powerhouse in Rome and yeah conquer the world and it's pretty cool um, hopefully we will have fun with this game definitely want to play it see how far we can take it and if we succeed and as usual this is a learning by doing thing for me um, I said I played it before but of course there's uh, um, guys out there who are super pro in this game and I'm always looking forward to your feedback if you have battle strategies and stuff there's a lot of theory crafting with this game so yeah all right so we're gonna go for no battle time limit Manage all settlements. Yeah, we want to manage all our settlements, I'd say. Um, what is the short campaign? Okay, yeah. Alright, alright, alright. Medium difficulty. I think medium difficulty would be okay for us. We just want to have fun, casually play it, and not take it to the max. Maybe if we find out it's too, you know, easy or whatever, we could crank it up. But for a start, to make it not that frustrating, I think it's all right. Yeah, just medium. All right, that's good. High advice advice level. That can be a bit annoying. We might switch it off, but you can always shut them down if they talk too much. The advices. Okay. So, which fraction do we want to pick? Bruti? Skippy? Or the Julie? <laughs> okay. So, the Julie. Mm -hmm. Alright. We don't want to. You know, I just like. Like Bruti. Yeah. They're very good with politics. Yeah. I like him. Let's take the Bruti. We start here down. It's also a nice starting position, I feel. You know, you start here and probably can expand your empire out. And I like their symbol. The sword. The lightning. Yep. Don't want arcade style battle. Manage our settlements. Folly a AI characters. Whatever that is, we we'll leave it. We can uncheck it. I think if it's disturbing. Okay, we're not gonna go for the short campaign, I assume. Or well, that. No, that sucks. Okay, we want to become the supreme ruler, uh, ruler of Rome and control at least 50, 50 provinces, that's for sure. Okay, I think manage all settlements should be alright. I hope so at least. Let's start the campaign. Let's get into it. We Brutii are the only true Romans. We saved Rome. We drove out the kings. We made the Republic. The family deserve respect. <laughs> Respect and obedience. We yes. know what is best for Rome. New lands, 
Living space, territory, slaves. I know what must be done. I think the we picked Greeks the right fraction, faction here. Down there. Knows us at all Romans, and they hate us. I'm going to give them a reason for hate. When I've crushed them, Roman steel. That's the answer. Roman steel in a booty eye fist. Oh, yeah. I like his attitude. And the other great Roman families. The Scipii. Trash. They have no respect for proper Roman ways. For us, the Julii prostitute Julii, themselves. Julii, Scipii, the Crushemi. <laughs> we Brutii must lead Rome. Brutii? <laughs> oh yeah, Brute I am. Alright, let's see if we can get into it. Let's try to avoid many noob mistakes, but yeah, it can happen. Okay. The Senate takes you to ask this settlement for the glory of the Empire. You will be greatly rewarded. Uh -huh. Where is our troops? Where are we sitting? This is our towns. Okay. I should have looked at... Oh, where's the mes messages? Um. Okay. So this is the overview map, um, where I basically run the show. And right now we own, let's see, one, two towns. Tarentum, it's a large town, and Croton. We have 5,000 bucks. All right. Let's see what we have in our city. Tarentum looks like our main capital yeah we're losing money here in Croton okay it has a governor's villa stables we can make make some um, cavalry we have barracks we have a port mm -hmm. okay that's our uh -huh, uh -huh. we have trade route I think we have a trade route going on here yep okay we have normal wooden palisades, we have normal roads and we have a land clearance it produces food, okay let's see where that is somewhere there, we're clearing land, okay that's not too spectacular so yeah we start up pretty poor let's have a look at our army in the town, Velites and Hasiati Hastati, excuse me Okay, one of our generals in there, here the same. What do we have here? At your service. A spy. Alright, we can send him on assassination missions, that is good. Orders! Alright. This is our main army as it looks, not very impressive. This is our general guard. Yeah. We keep them together. Imperative. He has 26 horseback riders with him. All right. Orders. And we got another troop here. Mm -hmm. All right. They're neutral. Skippy. We're allies with them still. All right. Good. Sir. So what was the city? What what city? What, the strength what of an want? army is shown on its banner. The more color on the banner, the more men are present. Any style? Yeah, obvious. Okay, let's get our troops merged. Move out. Yep, and try to expand our our grasp over there. Forward, general, onward. Can we already <coughs> Move depleted, sir. preach that? Not possible, sir. March. Which city did I tell us to attack? I skipped it. I didn't remember. Wait, I have to quick it, quickly look it up. Or can we get information somewhere? Senate. Senate officer. Family tree. Okay, that's us there. 
Getting the kids going, that's good. Good, 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 good. Okay, diplomacy, Senate, Senate missions, here you go. Yeah, Apollonia. We wanted to go for that anyway. Yeah, that was the goal, obviously. Alright, so we have to conquer that. Can we? Sir! March! Okay, maybe we need to make a ship and load our troops on there. I don't remember if it was like that in this game. But we also should take care of our cities. And Shri is playing SimCity Deluxe. Awesome. <laughs> okay, um, let's go to the town and see. We should definitely look into paved roads, paved roads um, to improve trade, you know, and that will cost, of course, more money. That is for sure. We need to create some income in there. What's the public order? 125? Okay. What would she suggest? At this time, suggest? it would be a sound strategy to build paved roads yeah. in this settlement. They exactly. help trade and allow fast movement of armies. It will take three rounds to build. That's what I wanted to do. Paved roads is always very important. If you ever played Civilization, you know that. <laughs> okay. Um, let's see. At this time, it would be a sound strategy yeah. to build paved She's roads. She's all into in the roads. Settlement. That was my they idea. They help trade well. and allow fast movement of armies. Mm hmm. All right, that's what we're doing. For now, it starts up slow. There's nothing much we can do at the moment. We can send sure. a diplomat out, maybe to Syracuse. Without delay. Send him down there. And we probably want to take our spy with us into the army here. My way. Merge it so we can send a spy on a little mission. Counter spy. Counter spying. Uh -huh. Counter spying. Okay, I think we can end this turn here. Solid start, I assume. Soon find out. Oh, this man is suitable addition to the family. Do you want him to marry your noble daughter and become like a son? Yes, of course. A garrison commander, okay. Young of age, 16 years old. We're gonna, tr we're gonna take him in our in our group. Diplomatic information. Uh -huh, the Greeks don't like us. Good. Mm -hmm. He's in our capital, Tarentum. The new generals always show up in the capitals. All right. Cool. Before we start recruiting and all, I better try to conquer the city here first. Okay, so let's Sir. move out. Boarding. Get our army on the ship here. Counter spying. Now bring them Aye, over. Captain. Yes, Captain. All ashore. Sweet. And now we want to siege the city. Besieging settlement, sir. Yes. Okay. So um, they could last for three turns uh, and th then they have to come out and fight. I think we will siege them. Settlement under siege, sir. Try to weaken them a bit. And while we do that, can we build us some siege weapons? Let's see. Imperator. Um, where the siege? Where is the siege going on? Imperator. Here. Engage the enemy. Ah, sadly we can't. Oh, it's not. It's not even required. They have no walls or what? Don't they have any walls? This scroll contains your options for besieging enemy settlements. Left click mm -hmm. on mm -hmm. Show Me. Mm -hmm. Let's maintain the siege here. Siege, what are we waiting for? You know what, guys? Look at that. They're weak. Let's attack. Let's charge in. Engage the enemy. Immediately. They only got 241 men. We should be super superior. 
gonna fight the battle on the map, of course. So you guys see how the the 3D action sequences <laughs> go in this game. They did a great job back in the days, you know. They got a lot of credit for their great, um, yeah, um, graphics back in the Rebellious days and the cool engine. Okay, let's but start the deployment. So this is how it always starts. Um, if we want to attack a city, this is our troops here. We got our generals. And generals are very powerful. They are very important. They can boost the morale of your troops. Then we have, we have another cavalry here that is really good, light cavalry. They are not as powerful as your yeah, general troops. And yeah, then we have a few um, basic troops, Hastadis. And we have some Velites that can throw some spears. You want to protect them a bit, of course, from incoming troops. And yeah, I think the deployment is done for now. We don't have to change anything. This is a pretty simple battle in the beginning and I would say we just march up slowly we can speed up the time we want we don't want to we don't want to run now to waste um, energy we are just gonna march up there and you can of course also you know um, set up your troops in certain formations and different lineups. It's pretty cool. It was well done for a game yeah, in this time and basically revolutionized the style of gameplay. Pretty legendary series actually. So yeah. You can move around with the directional keys. The game is um, you know pretty cheap. It's only 10 bucks on Steam and I got some kind of a special editions I always also got a few expansion packs with it yeah so that's pretty cool so let's see their main troops are sitting at the city center there just waiting for us so I'd say we take the we take our horses I didn't see any any mean meanies in there like you know guys there's guys with long lances stuff with long spears. You can also of course assign numbers. Make it easier to control your tro troops. So this is our troop one. The horses now. Ah yeah, they got some spear the spear guys. Move over here. Speed up the time a bit. Those are gonna assign the number. Just need to get it organized a bit here too. All right. And you guys are number three. And then we have another troop here with the horses. Control fear four. Yo yo, why doesn't it work? One two. Control four. Oh, we can only assign three or what? Five, three. Yeah, looks like it. That's weird. Didn't remember it was like that. Oh well. Whatever. Okay. Let's move three over to here. Two. Throw some spears at them. We're under attack. All right. I'm moving in. Let's charge at them. We don't want to, you know, clash with the. Um, Pilates uh, with the spearmen with our horses that is very bad but the horses could actually be right over there and we gotta try to flank him you can see the spears flying our spearmen are doing a good job deploying their spears into the enemies Yes. Be praised. The 
enemy general is dead. Took down that general. Ha <laughs> Okay, we got our horseman coming in. Now we got to surprise him. The oh. enemy army is in flight. Pursue them and drive them from the battlefield. We already won. That was quick. End the battle. Wrong Clear victory. victory. We don't have to chase him down. And this day is clearly our victory. Yes. We lost a few men, but we destroyed the opponent. Ha! <laughs> awesome. Our first city captured. That's good. That's good. That's good. Victory! That should bring us some love in Rome. Yes. We are not gonna, you know. There, there can be res some resistance in the cities if you are f moving uh, um, forward fast. You know, you might want to exterminate your populace so they don't have the population in there, so you don't have to uh, leave too many armies back in the settlement. But for now, we're gonna occupy it. We are planning to stay here for a sec and quickly recover. So let's see what can be done in this city. At the moment it only has a governor's house, it's pretty lame. So I'd say we already... Temple of Mars, Temple of Juno, don't we have a Temple of Jupiter? Mars... What temples do we have in our other cities? None. Could make some of these. Okay, yeah, they should definitely be pacified. Let's give them a Shrine of Mars. It will cost us 400 denarii. It will be done in one round. Public order is all right. We should recruit peasants at least. Four. So I have the city protected a bit. That will take a few turns. Construction-wise, we are okay. Yep, hopefully we don't get attacked from the back here, but this is our allies at the moment, so it should be alright. In Croton, <coughs> we are constructing the paved roads in here as well, that will take an additional two turns. And yeah, hopefully we please the Senate. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Senate floor. Okay, we are not we're pretty neutral at the moment. In the Senate, the people... Okay. Freaking July. Juli, July. Are loved more. Diplomacy. We have our old allies. We're Okay, we have no protectorates. Oh, they have more enemies already. <laughs> Finances. Okay, Senate gave us money. Mm -hmm. Okay. Later on, <coughs> auto manage is important for certain settlements when they are to completely grown, or when you when you have 50 or more to, um, yeah, control. Okay. Fraction ranking. We are tracking along. Nothing much happened. That's our family tree. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. We want to get in there. We want to climb the ranks in the Senate. Hopefully that will work out soon. Okay, so that was our first successful occupation of a settlement. And now there's nothing left than waiting around. Let's see what comes next. Oh, okay. The Senate asks you to send a fleet to placate this port. Yeah, okay, okay. <coughs> we can do that in Syracuse. We have some fleet here. Hi, Captain. Admiral Marcus. His tree Remre fleet. That's good. Yeah, we can, we can do that. No, no. Ah, yeah, of course. We are at war. Let's bring our fleet over there. Good. Can we make... Um, let's quickly get into the town. 
just want to make a ship here. Oh, some war dogs. That's uh, just cool to have. Let's get some war dogs. We want to strengthen our army over here and at the same time build a uh, backup army in home. So we got want to get a boat. We can transfer armies over there. We want to put some dogs in there maybe. And maybe we can also recruit in Croton. What could we recruit there? Do we have... Yeah, why not? Town watch. That's alright. Militis. Yeah. Let's make two town watch guys. Here as well. And the road should be done soon. It will cost us quite some money what we're doing here. Hopefully... We we'll don't, yeah, we won't run out of balance. We're making money in Apollonia, which is nice. Got a fishing village in there. Okay, he's sending a diplomat our way. All right, I think we can end this turn once again. End of turn. Marriage. Who married? Somebody. Construction reports. Yes, we got our paved roads done. That should improve our financial situation, hopefully, and make us able to travel faster. We always want to keep up with that and try to have that going in our empire. Okay. Wooden wall, military barracks would be good, so we can get better troops going. Trader. Oop. What does the trader do? Yeah, tradable goods. Hmm. Yep. I think we wanna we wanna make some money. Let's build a trader here for two rounds, and here we wanna make a port, so we can actually have some trade routes and also mines. That will give us money, dude. That is actually more important in the short run. Yeah, let's get these mines going we need to make that money normal tax rate at the moment it's okay good here what are we constructing the trader yeah that's okay here we got the temple done which is awesome Yep, and we should get a wooden palisade. It will give us some better defenses later on. You can have bow shooters if you have nice walls. Put the bow shooters on the walls. You can pretty much uh, do crazy damage. Okay, recruitment. Mm -hmm. This is good. And after we have the wooden palisades. Why can't we um, build a harbor in here? Uh, the fishing village maybe takes the role of that. What does the land clearing do? Yeah. Food. Get more food from it. Trader barracks. That is definitely needed after that. Okay, and then we. What would she su suggest? At this time, it would be a sound strategy to build a trader in this settlement. Trade creates wealth, which can be taxed. Yep, 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 yep. We're getting the traders. Okay. Here we are good. Here we are good. Okay. End the turn. <coughs> Our ship is going down to Syracuse. Blocking the port, that's what the Senate asked us to do. And we got a diplomat coming. What does he want? Trade rights. Yeah. Maybe we can, we can ask him to give us a, a region. <laughs> like a counter offer. Make demand. Give us car. Um, give us that. Let's 
Sí. They would give us a whole province. Uh, it's off a dam. Five hundred. Let's see. For 12 turns, are you? No, I'm not going to do that. Well, okay. Then... Let's stick with that. For now. We're going to negotiate again. But that was uh, not a bargain, man. I can't pay 1,500 for 15 rounds. Are you serious? Or 12. Too bad. But that would have been a nice... Nice way. Okay. The Senate asked you to take this settlement for the glory of the Empire. All willing to do that. Oh. We want to capture that. We want to capture that. Okay. Syracuse. We are holding up the blockade. War. Yeah, now we got it. The Greek cities are on us. Successful Senate. Okay. Ah. Cool. Games for me. That's good. Announcement. Okay. Games held in our name. That's good. Nice bonus there. Games for the people. Construction. Our wooden palisades are done. That's also nice. Recruitment. Town watch and stuff is building up. War declared. Okay, lots of war going on. Okay, now we block the port of Syracuse. That our allies there. We can keep it up. Why not? Just block them a bit. Uh, we're losing money though. I think we were trading with them. It sucks. Maybe we can start trading with these guys. We need to make roads. But I think, yeah. What are we constructing next? Exactly. The barracks, train, and then roads. And the land clearance. Let's just keep them busy. What is our troops doing? Can we repair our... No, we just need the barracks here. Otherwise, we can't move on. We didn't lose much of our troops. Let's see. Orders, Those two guys. You stay here. You need to we could take him with us, actually. Orders. No, we should not. Let's take them, 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 them. Them. Should be alright. Let's move out. Forward. Move, sir. Sir. Yes. Should be able to capture the city next. Haha. -ha. Yep. I'm enjoying it already. Guys, let me know. I want to bring back Total War on the channel as a daily, probably. You know, we're just going to keep on playing and trying to make progress and conquer the world. The plan is at the moment as a daily. Episodes maybe around 20 to 25 minutes. Um, the same way I handled it with other games in game time. Would be great if you could give me feedback about it. Um, it would be cool um, if you could show some fo support for this first episode of the new season here. The new game show. And yeah, let me know if you like it in... You know, that's also important. Do you want me to play Rome Total War? I asked in the farming simulator videos. And you guys seem to like the idea. So I thought, okay, let's pick it up. And yeah, maybe we can also try other franchises of the Total War series. Alright, that's it for today. I'm out. See you later, guys.